With many cars these days, you can manipulate the power and handling characteristics at the push of a button. This technology is now available on today's super motocross bikes, which helps the rider become more consistent off the start and on the various track conditions. The 2024 Kawasaki KX450 comes with a new Rideology interface. You change how the engine's working, similar to what you would do in a vehicle that you're driving. So in a vehicle, there's a sport mode, there's an economy mode, and maybe there's a comfort mode. The same applies to the KX450. Those controls consist of a mapping button, traction control button, and a launch control. The launch control affects the ignition and fuel and traction control and ends with the bike shifting into third. The launch control consists of two settings. The first setting being a somewhat normal setting that one would use on a normal condition. And the second setting is something that one would use in a slipperier condition. There's also a power mode button. You decide that you need a little bit more control of the engine. This will help with that. The first map being a normal map and the second map being something that one would use in a muddy or low grip situation. The traction control consists of three different levels. The first level is off. The second level is a slight amount of traction control and the third level provides the most traction control. The traction control system will work in any type of slippery situation. It could be dry slick or it could be wet slick. Anything that would make the tire spin and the RPM spike. When that happens, then the traction control system starts working. For us, this new technology has really helped our race team. Say, for instance, going from a dry track to a muddy track, it's very handy to have the ability to change the map on the fly once we're down there and understand what the conditions are. Whereas previously, we had to do it in the pit area.